Yo, what's happening guys? It's Unhost here from Native Visions, and today we'll be talking a little bit about pulse lengtheners or pulse extenders. They're both the exact same thing. Uh, the point of them is to send an output signal that will constantly power your uh, your desired output for a certain delayed amount of time. And these are four different models. They all act the same. They have one wire that sends a direct signal and another piece of circuitry that will delay the time that the redstone wire for the output is lit. So, so yeah, these are. I think this was the first model made. You could see it acts like so. It's a little inefficient because if you would like to use it again just after, you'd have to wait for these repeaters to shut off. Uh, this one's a little bulkier, and actually the time that it takes for the first signal to get there is a little bit delayed, so I really don't use, like to use this one. Uh, this one might be my favorite here. Very compact, very sleek. And obviously these blocks, after being hit by the uh, repeater, will power the redstone dust here. And yeah, it's it's very, like I said, sleek, compact, and efficient. And finally, here's another design here, just one wide. Acts the same way. Your top layer will send a direct signal, while the bottom will delay the signal. And as you can see, the redstone wire here is constantly lit. So yeah, the main reason I use these is for, uh, in my world, use them for a lot of doors, to keep the doors open for a little bit, and also use them for my cave spider spawner trap, uh, as well as a blaze trap. So yeah, if you guys have any questions, please leave a comment below. If you guys can't tell how to make them, I'll be more than happy to make a tutorial on these. Just uh, let me know what's up. Appreciate you guys. Adios.